from Western New York's Information Center. Channel 2 News at 6 starts now. An escaped inmate at the Erie County Holding Center surrenders to police, ending an hours-long ordeal in downtown Buffalo. Plus, local hospital officials speak out about the mandated swine flu shot for health care workers. And making strides, thousands of cancer survivors brave the rainy weather for a chance to help save lives. From Storm Team 2, your forecast first. Looking at tonight, 47 degrees, scattered showers. Monday, looking at a high of 57, rain comes to an end. Well, today's rainy weather didn't stop thousands of local breast cancer survivors from hitting the pavement. This was the scene in downtown Buffalo this morning as the annual Making Strides Against Breast Cancer 5K walk kicked off. The walk, which raises money for the American Breast Cancer Society, is traditionally the largest breast cancer walk in western New York. I've been with the society for eight years. This is the first year that we've actually had rain. And although we have rain, we do have a number of dedicated survivors and their families and people that are interested in helping finding a cure for this disease. They came out today and they're helping every step they take is helping us get one step closer. Today marked the 14th year for the event here in Western New York. 6,000 people came out for the event, raising a half million dollars. And over in